Hey, what's going on, guys? Wait. Oh, hold on. Cheers. <sighs> there we go. Now I can start this video. It's Friday. We made it. It's a subscribers video today. So, a couple new people sent some stuff in. Um, and I think you're going to like it. It's pretty cool. Um, so, got a couple of goodies. I'm going to show you. I got uh, the copper cell going. I figure I'm not going to do too much recording on it because you've seen quite a bit out of them anyways. Um, and it's another just a small scale copper cell. I am trying with wire and low amps. So I could crank them up. Uh, I can't say it's super low amps. I'm running like one volt or two. Yeah, one volt DC at 0 0.2, uh, 0.2 amps. So come here, you little turd. Uh, she's she's going to be part of it. She might as well be in it, right? Okay. She's the sassy one. Actually, she's not very sassy. The tailed one is the sassy one. Anyways, um, yeah, a couple of goodies. So, uh, made some copper sulfate this go-around. I didn't make it with the, um, the style I'd recorded last time with the sulfuric, the nitric, um, and the distilled water. I just made it out of distilled water and copper sulfate for uh, for like root killer I think it's 99% fine so basically everything that was kind of left in the bottom I just filtered out piece of cake and I just added until I had a couple crystals left in the bottom so I knew my solution was full and uh, for for good conductivity through there through my uh, solution but uh, I think the crystals are actually looking pretty nice they're nice and uh, nice and nice and clear and uh, I can't say clear, but clear as in uh, they're, they, they don't look like McDirty's uh, cathodes. I'll tell you that right now. They look pretty nice. Um, and I'm not doing the stainless. I used the stainless bar last go around. I'm using copper wire. I want to see if I can get some cool looking crystals. Maybe. Uh, so I've got one more bar to give away for the uh, subscribers video. Another copper bar. So I want to see if I can get some cool shaped crystals. And uh, maybe put them in some like glass jars or something. A little bit of distilled water, some tape around them, and those will be a giveaway for at least a couple months. I'll try to change it up so it's not just the same thing, especially if we have the same win winners and over and over again, right? You don't want to like thirty different bars, <laughs> Tim. <laughs> Anyways, I think we'll get somebody to dethrone you soon enough, but. Uh, that's all good. Anyways, oh, I got other stuff too. So, ferrous sulfate. See if we can drop some uh, some gold that route. I also want to try to make some too. Just have been crazy busy lately. I can't believe it's already the end of September. I'm gonna be doing another giveaway here soon for the uh, subscribers giveaway. That's uh, that's what last week friday next week one more oh it's coming up i can't believe how fast i mean it's like we got fall colors in the air or in the leaves and here she is here she is see no tail other one's got a tail it's actually really long she looks kind of like a lemur but uh <laughs> but i want to drop the gold because i think in for 700 sub giveaway um I want to do something with my one ounce gold. Not necessarily uh, have that part of it. Give it away because I've worked my tail off for that one right now. Eventually, you know, maybe like maybe like seven thousand or you know seven thousand subs. We'll, we'll, we'll think about something like that. But that that's a long way off. But no, I'd like to tag it with the um, uh, the re the refining of that that one ounce, so I want to refine all of that together and have just a really nice one. And uh, I'm thinking for the 700, we should be able to do that. Cause I think I've got, I think I've got over an ounce right now. Um, I just have to get it yet. So I think I got like nine nine grams left, and that should put me well over the 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 one ounce mark. Get my first one ounce. Gold homemade, Ugh, really stoked for it. 
Anyways, I'll stop yapping at you. Let's get on to uh, on your goodies. They got some really cool stuff. So here's one of my projects I just started. We got uh, another copper cell running. Got some beautiful crystals there. Actually made it out of uh, copper sulfate this go around. And that's about a pound of melted relays. This is the stuff I made it out of. Seems to be working really well. All right, we got Hill 1312's experiments. So the first picture here, you can see his lab. You got a nice setup, nice outdoors, nice and safe. That's how we like it. Um, this is all for fun, but you know, we all gotta go home. And uh, here we go, he's got, this is his copper cell. And he sent me this, I said, man, that looks like a brain. He's like, no, nah, it looks like coral. And sure enough, in the copper cell, it looks exactly like a coral reef. Copper cell, oh, I shouldn't say all cells. They just, it's, it's so fascinating. And here he's got a ton of silver chloride here, ready to, uh, ready to be taken care of. Lion sugar method, I'm thinking. We got Tim Toolman's, though so this is, uh, he's got a bunch of stuff here. So this right here is, if you've, so if you looked at, uh, Omega Geek 64's videos, uh, this is the process that Tim went through to get, Tim, uh, to get Mike from Omega, this beautiful copper wire, nice and easy to, uh, to refine. And here we got his updates on his copper cell. You can see he's got, uh, so this was thermostat wire and the crystal growth on there is, is really nice. I can't wait to see what those turn out to. The last couple of crystals you put out were, were really cool looking. We got MMF Shooters, Gold Recovery. So he sent me this, and this is him refining. Uh, it was vintage watch cases, so which are actually pretty good. If you have the opportunity to pick some up or find some, those are the way to go. I, uh, I've always had good luck with them. But here's got some nitric pass going on. Get rid of all that base metal. And uh, in here we got some AR, it looks like. Aqua Regia. Got to dissolve the gold so we can precipitate that nice and clean. And you got 17.5 out of that. That is a nice chunk of gold right there. More than a half ounce. And Keith. So this is, uh, we haven't seen Keith's projects before, so we got a bunch of them. So he sent us all of his e-waste he's got. So he's got some, some work to do. There is no question about that. If, uh, if anybody has any ideas on how to depopulate all of this, um, you know, in, in without a, uh, how do I say this, um, commercial scale, I should say, you know, that would, be, that would be awesome. I'm sure that would help him out tremendously. I mean, look at them all. Look at all those boards, all those IC chips and all sorts of stuff. Tons of it. You got a, a lot of precious metals there. I, I really look forward to the progress on some of this stuff. Oh, a big old chunk of aluminum there. IBM, I just did one of those. Look at that. All them IC chips. And here he's uh, in the process of ashing them. He actually did a really nice job. Look at how white those are. And here's some silver wire he's been, uh, been refining as well. We got 0 0.05 grams of silver out of that. And here's some coins. So... He said to me that he checked all the dates to verify that none of those were important and they all had damage, a lot of damage to them, whether they were cut or people drilled holes into them or something along those lines. So they're basically just worth the, their, their weight and, and melt. And this is why he re refined them. And he did a, a wonderful job. And look at that. It's really nice looking. All right. And the real reason why you guys are here today 600 sub giveaway it is here i'm gonna draw for it um 
So if you watch my shorts, I got everybody um, who put the 600 sub giveaway in the comment section. I got you on a piece of paper. What I'm going to do is I just got your name written down on there with the number. And I've bought some lottery balls or whatever you want to call them. Little red balls. That's, that was in another short too. And they sent me all sorts of doubles in there. It was supposed to be like 1 through 100. And I got like two of all sorts of them. So I had to go through them individually. And it was a process. It was fun. Um, so I got everything out. 1 through 37. 37 different people um, entered. So what I'm going to do is I got 1 through 37. Go ahead and put them in the hat. Um, I'll put them in the clean hat, not this one. And we'll pick one out. We'll pick, well, we'll pick three out. I figured uh, I wanted to be able to get a good, like, stir in there. And I don't know if the paper was, like, actually stirring properly. So I think this will be a better, a better, uh, well, an actually more random uh, opportunity for everybody. So I'm hoping it works a little better. Um, it was, uh, it was actually worked really well. I liked, I liked that. Um, you guys boosted that video up quite a bit, so I really appreciate that. So, anyways, I'll keep, uh, I'll stop yapping at you, and we'll get onto that drawing. All right, so here's everybody. I'm gonna go nice and slow, and you see your number on there. Thirty-two. I had some doubles on there. That's why those are crossed off. There you go. Thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, and thirty-seven. All right. Here's everybody's number. Turned into a, a lottery ball. So I think we can get really good stirring action for a really good uh, pull. So here we go. All right. Who is number one? Can't see. Looking at you. Looking at you. It's pretty good. I think that's a pretty good stir. I feel like we're getting a really good stir out of that. Uh, see him. Okay. We'll do it again. Oh, oh. Keep stirring. And the first draw. Whoosh. 28, number one. All right, I got to look who that is. Um, and I got to put those in order. All right, number two. Ah, give it a good stir again. Who is number two? 15 is number two. All right, number three. Let's see what we got. Mm. Show the hand. All right. And we'll do the hand again. Uh, the hand. All right. Going to draw number three. 37. All right. Well, congratulations, guys. Let's go see who they are. All right. So 28. Who is number 28? Tammy. Congratulations, Tammy. You are number one. First. There we go. Sorry, hard to do the camera and the. All right, number two. 15. Right here. User EN81K1DG1R. I'm not sure who that is. Hopefully, you do. You are number two. Uh, hold on. And second. Perfect. All right. And 37. Trevetras. Trevetras? You were number third. Number third. You were in third place. There we go. There's the English language for you. <laughs> All right. Congratulations, guys. All right, congratulations again, guys. First place, bam, that's what you're gonna get right there. I'm really jealous, because I don't have one of those yet. I really want one, so, ugh.
I'm gonna have to. You're gonna have to tell me how it works. You're gonna have to tell me how it works. All right, second place. Uh, right here. Boom. It's roughly 15 grams. Silvers. Uh, refined by yours truly. And uh, it hasn't been through a cell, so it's it's. I can't say four nines or three nines fine even, but I it is really clean. Um, I was really happy with how this cleaned up. So if you want to see the video on how these uh, um, were made, I've got one previously. Um, I think it's labeled 600 sub giveaway. Or no, I'd have to look back up on that one. I'll uh, put a link in the description for it if you're interested. And third place. So again, thank you guys so much. Um, I really appreciate everything you guys have done for me. Uh, all the information, all the knowledge that you guys shared. This has been the coolest adventure that I've probably been on through all the hobbies that I've done. Um, the fact that everybody is uh, so open with... This is going to sound corny, but like embracing arms, right? You know, like that. so willing to help share knowledge. It's... It's a really cool community, and I'm really glad you guys are part of it. Um, well, I'm, I'm glad to be a part of your community, I should say. Um, and thank you guys for, for helping me and, and also including me in your community. It's, it's, it's really cool. So, hey, you guys have a, a great weekend. Stay safe. I, uh, I hope to see I have more comments from you. So, uh, you know, you, you can't do that if you go too hard, right? So thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Oh, before I forget, if you won, email me. Link in description. Uh, need the address so I can get everything to you. All right. Hey, thanks again, guys. I'll see you in the next one.